yes, we just arrived at B&M. As you can see, they've got their pot needles, chicken mushroom 50p, and also, what's that one? The whole curry on them beef and tomato. So I can get myself a couple of beef and tomato. B&M as you can see they've got their pot needles, chicken mushroom 50p and also what's that one? The whole curry on them beef and tomato so I can get myself a couple of beef and tomato I do send that one in for ages and I see Mrs. just bring myself a, chicken, a couple of the chicken curries in yeah I know Fiona from My Crazy Life Scotland was on about these Mars Snickers and also the tricks is there they look they're quite tiny aren't they but they're still in um, but they're not too bad, so if you want a little chocolate fix or something like that. And as you can see, B&M have got their Easter eggs and they've got the radio ones there for £6. The flake ones there. Toffee crisps. Munchies. What's that one? Celebrations. And then your food. Samuel always said he wants a big chocolate button one, doesn't he? Mm. Do I get some of some... Yeah, do I get some of some jellies? Um... Get those ones every right? One pound nine for three. Get two packets of those and enjoy those. Money. Right, I need some cereal for me. They've got lucky charms here. They've got any lucky charms? No. They've got the chocolate ones. I got some chocolate ones for Christmas and I wasn't all that I ate them, but I wasn't that keen on them. I prefer the normal ones. I don't think they've got any, have they? There you go, see if one he wants, a white Oreo one. <laughs> yeah, don't get a packet of those. Mm. Yeah, get in there, yeah. Because obviously they're, glu they're gluten free and they're the only crackers that Ben likes. That's the reason why I've come here for, just get these crackers. Oh, yeah, it's different. Fresh chocolate cream one, isn't it? Yeah. They're different, aren't they? Got a Bailey's one there. Do I get some, some of those cookies as well? Because he likes those ones, doesn't he? And they're only 6 and 9 They're quite cheap, actually, to be honest with you. Mm. Yeah, no. yeah, get yeah, pack of those. Oh, no, they're, they're wrong ones, they're 49p. The ones that didn't want those ones. I meant those ones up there, but I oh, know I love them anyway. I love those cookies. Those ones are the ones with the crunch rainbow ones. 
Somebody doesn't like them. Oh, who went in the last packet then? Did you eat the last packet? No, I didn't have them. Well, they disappeared out the cupboard. Yeah, so while I'm here, I'll go and get myself some seeds because I actually applied them late last year and they didn't grow properly. So if I get myself some um, runner beans, packet of those, um, packet of peas. I enjoy doing my own peas last year, so I get a packet of them as well. Get some parsnips. Again, they're on three for the price of two, so they're pretty good actually. What have I got around here? Sweet corn. Tomatoes, I normally grow tomatoes from seeds, so I wait not seeds from um, from plants. I'm going to probably get them set them sometime in the spring or something like that. And obviously you go here, got some cabbage, Brussels, carrots, iceberg lettuce, butternut squash. I haven't got no cores yet. We had some really, really success last year with our um no cores yet, so see if we can get them on. So they were really nice actually. I've got squash, I'll go off them might get some lemons so that sort of thing instead. Yes, yeah, so I just put some of these dairy milk bunnies in, you can see they had the orange ones. They're only a pound, I fancy trying some of them, hopefully they'll be nice. I was actually looking for the white chocolate um, Malteser bunny things, but I can't seem to find a different they've got in those. I know Tesco's do them, and they are, they're really nice, they are. I prefer white chocolate anyway. Just put Ben some caramel, and he likes the buttons, but I can't seem to find any of the buttons. But he'll be right for them, I'll take them for him for school. There you go, look at all these cream eggs. Got caram. Oh, they're different. They've got a mixture of cream egg and caramel eggs. We have some sign in there. You yeah, get back at 10, add on the last. And also got to tell what, get back at them for myself as well. They can go to the trolley now. Got the cream, um, don't need the water, something like that, do we? Got some juice and stuff. I think we're right for juice, aren't we? And also, um, we're right for the cap with some things. I think the Sammy wants school dinners next week or not. Next week he'll score dinners, doesn't he? And these are ideal for him. But then again, he's got his bottle. You can take his bottle to school. We can then refill out that way, I think. Do we need any um, dishwasher tablets? Are we all right? Uh, just get some. I get some, yeah, what they said. What ones I get? Don't really matter, does it? They go Quantum 72. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so I just put some of these um, surf um, tablets in there. They were actually only... Four ninety nine, I believe it or not. How much in there? For 50? I thought they were alright. Gone for surf. Never had surf before, so hopefully it should be alright. Obviously, um, them. Don't think down there, do all the like, clothes and they've got plenty of clothes. Yeah, my proper toothpaste back, please, darling. Cause okay. one, yeah, go to a lot, share. Yeah. Because one I've got, it doesn't taste very nice. And it'll be right for the kids because Sam likes that toothpaste, so I've got to see if we're fine. Deodorant. Yeah, we need some deodorant, don't we? Because the kids are using so much of it. This will do for the kids. Want to? What's that? I need some, some shaving cream, don't you? You're yeah. right for razors and stuff, yeah? yeah. Um, smelly. St yeah, I'll just put some in for the kids, look. Yeah. yeah. I need some more, I know, because the kids use it. I'm right for shampoo. I want to dye my hair again. I'm fed up with the colour of my hair. I've always had some purple hair, haven't I? But see, was told me to get to the one hair just open properly to get it done. So I might get them for my birthday. I remember when I dyed my hair red once went orange. <laughs> that was funny. Um, oh, yeah, that colour. Well, yeah, I do like that colour actually, it's quite nice. Yeah. You want a hairbrush, don't you, for yourself? Or a comb? Yeah, they're all quite they're all girly those ones are at the minute. Tell you what, I do like these actually, these glow in the dark sports ottomans. They're um ten pounds, but I was looking for a big massive storage container to put the like bed's clothes in in, but I don't think that'd be big enough. I also got like the little um the glow in the ducks, the um the cube things to match. Again, it'll be nice in Sammy's room. Obviously Sammy's room is quite tiny anyway. I do like nice and obviously like, also for the girls they've got like unicorns. There's some really lovely things in here today actually. Also the little storage cubes and things over here look tidy, sparkle and kitchen. I was thinking darling. If you get one of these non-slip mats, then that might help them on this plate. Or you need to do a microwave approach, don't you? Because yours, you break yours. Oh, well, they're a good idea, aren't they? Ah, not too bad, actually, are they? Yeah, see what? Get one of those, actually. Have they got a jug? 
That's no more jug, isn't it? I was looking for a food bowl. He was looking at all these dinner plates and stuff like that. Somewhere down the line, I'll replace ours. We've had ours years. And you can see they've started to test the age of time because obviously we live in the microwave, you know, like in the microwave and the dishwasher, they started to lose and, like the um, colours and things like that, little cracks. That's not bad actually, £16. Well, I do like the square plates, I think they look quite good, don't they? The square ones, £4 for a plate. I think when done now, I'll pose pop, they might pop in there, see what they've got. Look at the Dunning and Dunning on the Xbox and things like that. He hasn't played on his the Xbox much since he's had his Switch. Has he's always played on his Switch or the gaming things like that? Because bless him, Sammy said he wants a gaming channel, doesn't he, for YouTube? But I'm not that keen on having one, to be honest with you. I know we do have vlogs and things like that. They're good, aren't they? Get one of them. So yes, we're just doing the score run again. Now I'll tell you what, I quite enjoy doing the score run, actually, don't you? Again. Again, yeah. <laughs> I know Sammy really enjoys it, bless him, because he said, oh, keep me with my tablet and my drink and my snacks. Just, obviously, when he comes back in the taxi and stuff like that, it's not allowed. Anyway, yeah, so, um, went to B&M, obviously saw, went to Aldi, well, we did vlog in Aldi, did we, stuff like that. And, um, just had some lunch, over there, beef stew and dumplings and chicken stew and dumplings things for lunch. Too. They were really nice, really, really filling. And they were just sat there and um, watched the telly for a bit, just chilled out. They, you was listening to them at office, 10 day trends. What were they doing? The other guy, you know, he does it with him. Oh, I want him, I can't think of his name, maybe we're going to now. Yeah. Anyway, yes, yeah, so apparently there's a risk of snow again for next week, which is nice there's if it is. snow at the weekend as well. Apparently there is, so it's still that SSW, they had a couple of weeks ago, wasn't it? It's the battleground between the mild and the cold. Find out what was, then we find out what's when. So, again, it's nice looking nice. It is nice to see, it was nice to see the snow actually, wasn't it, last week anyway. Um, but who knows if we get some more, we get some more. I know in the back garden we've still got a little bit less snow left. <laughs> it's just the snowman's heads, no, not the heads, the bodies are left, isn't it? Yeah. Stuff like that. So I know Sammy keeps saying he wants some more. So, um, the thing is, I've got their snow boots, nothing like that. I did try to order some, but they've got any on stock. I think everyone had the same idea when they saw the snow. But anyway, hopefully, hopefully fingers crossed, the kids have had good days to school. Like I said, if, if Ben's had some positive moments, also well and good, but you can't expect him to have good days every day, can we? No. Not straight away, anyway. So, anyway, so I'll see you when we get to school with the Giddy Winkles. So, yes, yeah, so we're just back from doing the school run. Um, we're a bit later now than what we planned because we had to take the back way around. There's been a big, massive accident at the M40. Is it Junction 11? Yeah, all you're doing is seems to cooking dinner. So, yeah, so a big, big mass accident there. Um, I think they've had to close the motorway off for obvious reasons, which, of course, is expected down this way. And it's caused about a 10 mile tail back. So, just as well, we turned back when we did. It's, it's quite good, actually, because Sammy actually said, Oh, Sammy um. Sammy was warning me, there's a problem, there's a problem. Yeah, because obviously, because Sammy, um, was he, you know, it's like Sammy was into his maps and things like that. And he goes, Oh, Mummy, Dad, Daddy, there's a delay. And um, it's quite funny because Sammy was directing us on this sat now from this phone. We knew what way we had to go anyway, so to speak, didn't we? It was just like a little turn here and everywhere. But I'm glad we did actually because it wasn't fair on Ben to happen to put up with that either. Um, so we didn't, I said, we didn't have the greatest strain of that with Ben as well. He was banging his ears and things like that. But to me, it looked like he was in pain somewhere, didn't it? We really did. Come home. You know what? People think we're in a lockdown. There's so many people travelling. There is. There's loads of people around. It's just crazy. But anyway, yes, of course, we come home, give Ben some care, hold him, settle down a bit. But he has had some positive moments at school, which is good. He's um, been playing on the gym ball, interacting on the iPad. It's also been interacting and responding to some of his teachers, which is really good. So we just got to take the positive and negative days, really, haven't we? So, but I do like to do think he's definitely in pain somewhere. We did actually ask when we had this meeting last week. We all the professionals finally got together after eight, eight, nine months. And we had like I said, two hours in call last week. One of the suggestions there, we actually said, is he in pain somewhere? And um, we've actually asked for a brain scan. We've been asking for another brain scan now for both for the last two years. Um, because obviously this is when the headbangers got worse since then, but obviously it went away. 
and obviously it's now it has it, it's always stayed because obviously last time I had a brain scan was when he was diagnosed with epilepsy, wasn't he? He had one of them, you also had the egg thing where they put the electrodes in your head. So you never know they're missing anything, do you? You hear all these reports and things like that. So um, let's put on suggestions and obviously they got past it forward. So anyway, um, let's go and see how Sammy got on at school as well. So then, sweeter, how was school today? Very good. Yeah? Yeah, good day. Yeah. What have you done at school? Loads of things. What have you loads of things? Mm, I just had these normal Wednesday lessons. And what's that, maths? I'm sorry, it's not that. Today I've done language, design technology, maybe say and extensions today. Okay, yeah? Yeah. And you, which your pizza nice? Yeah. Yeah. That's good. So, what are we doing now? I'm on YouTube. It's also on YouTube. Okay. So Daddy's going to do stir fry for tea, yeah. is that alright, yeah? Yeah, I love, I love stir fry. Okay, it's fine. No. So that brings Wednesday's vlog to a close. It's not a too bad day to be honest. So we obviously we went to be and um, got a, got Ben's crackers, a few bits and pieces we got. Obviously got myself some seeds where I can start planting these. I'm not too quite sure when I can plant these from actually. Also, oh, so these can so indoors from April. These so I've got some runner beans. Same old story in Ballamore, you literally. Got some carrots. How many times do we grow these and half of them we never use? We do. And then got some butter squash. Got some courgettes. We have we have really really good luck with our um, success last year, didn't we? With our courgettes, they were absolutely massive. The biggest problem with those is the way we planted them. It was that's it was. And then this year we're going to plant them slightly different. Um, we've got some parsnips, and then also got some cucumbers as well for now. So these are just a few selections and stuff like that. Obviously, I don't want to get too many seeds yet because obviously we don't what's happening in the garden yet, do we? Um, nice that is looking garden, I hope. Yeah, that is our main concern this year, to try and get this garden set out. Obviously a charity will give us some money towards the garden. Obviously we just need to find uh, somebody to help do it, stuff like that. We've had a couple of quotes in. I think the most expensive quote we've had was about £15,000. And so far, the cheapest one after that is about two. So uh, I think it all depends on how much this charity will have funded as well. So, um, like I said, it needs to be done for better safety reasons, really, as well. So um, but one of the, what we are main concern, obviously, is getting the tree roots out and getting that big dip down at the bottom sort of out, and then obviously a safe place then for Ben's trampoline. So yeah, obviously, I certainly had a good day at school as well. I was teaching emails and stuff like that. He really enjoyed. In fact, he done some really fantastic descriptive writing or something today in English. And um, yeah, so I can also some positives from Ben's class as well. So anyway, guys, just want to say thanks for watching today. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe, and then we'll see you tomorrow at seven a.m. Bye, guys. Where are you going?